Good afternoon. Welcome back to my channel. If you don't know me, hi, hello, my name is Maya, and I am your host of Motivation and Muscles with Maya Ting. I don't have any water, that's a lie. I have some water on my husband's side of the bed that I am gonna partake in. I am watching 60 Days In. I think this is season seven. I think I've seen it before. I just rewatched season six. I'm about to rewatch season seven. I don't think I'm done with season seven. I don't really remember. But anyway, before I get all engrossed in that, um, let's go ahead and get our exercises done. And yes, I am one of those crazy people who would definitely do 60 days in. And not because I think I'm a bad behind, mm -mm. Um, but just because, first of all, it would be interesting, number one, and, num and humbling. And number two, I do believe in prison reform. And I do think that at least here in, in the United States, there's a lot that we can do to make our prisons better. Um, there are just some things that we take for granted right as free people however those who are incarcerated they're still human beings and they are being the majority of them denied their basic human rights for example women and i'm gonna get off this tangent in just a second women they own when they're on their cycle they get i hear three pads when i was getting a cycle way back then when um i can go through three pads in a half of a day right and so they're uh, left to their own devices. And it's a lot of other stuff, but yeah. And people say, well, that's what happens when you commit crimes and you go to prison. I get it, I get it, I get it, I do, I get it. But anyway, I'm gonna put you guys down and we're gonna go ahead and get our exercises done. I have my eight pound weights down there. Let me pull up my leggings. Anytime you see me doing that, it's because when I lean out just a little bit, my leggings, they kind of they kind of fall down. So I'm leaning out and not intentionally. I like the weight that I'm at right now. I like my physique where I'm at now. So but anyway, let's go ahead and get started. We have four sets. Don't get distracted by the cute kitty and the, the puppy who you can't see, but I'm sure he will come by. One step down, I'm gonna go ahead and put these eight pound weights away into the next set. Hey, Doobie. Your weights back up.
goes down right there. Let me grab me a bottle of water. Mm -hmm. Last one. One more set, and then we can chit chat for a bit. Last set. Best set. So thankful that we got that done and out of the way. Move this out of the way. I've got stuff everywhere. So it's too dark. Move duty. So we got that done. And oh, I finished setting up my Apple Watch. I have Mr. Teddy as my screensaver. I really would like to get Dooley Pop and Mr. Teddy together in a cute photo. Um, excuse me, so I can have them as my screensaver, but I can't seem to get them to be still. No worries, I'll catch it. But anyway, it's still the day after thanks Thanksgiving. It's still the day after Christmas, and I am just in cleaning mode. We are done with the festivities as far as the ones that we're hosting and I'm so thankful we go every year to my gym besties house for um, New Year's we're gonna do that because normally what I do is I sit in my house um, and as a family we binge watch Twilight Zone so we're gonna go ahead and binge watch Twilight Zone for Christmas I'm sorry New Year's Eve and then around 10 11 o'clock We'll head on over to um, my gym bestie. And then we'll bring in the new year, 1230. We're going to be home binge watching the Twilight Zone. So, yeah, that is it. And that is all. Um, I'm just cleaning up. That's the story of my life. And, um, yeah, so I'm going to go. Take your time when you're doing those exercises. Don't be like me and don't have on hand some water. You're going to need it, right? As far as what you can expect for the month of January, um, I'm trying to make it where you can use weights or not use weight. 
but I'll let you know. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited for the first of January, 2023 has been choose a finger 2023, but I'm thankful for you because I learned a lot of lessons. Um, but yeah, so, and then I think it's January 2nd at five o'clock, we have um, someone, a dog trainer who's gonna come in and give us a free consultation um, to talk about how we can go ahead and get him potty trained. Because, um, yeah, I'm just, I'm not doing a very good job. Mm -hmm. So, and I get all of these awesome, you know, words of encouragement and advice on how to do it. Yeah, it's, it's, it's not working. It's, it's not working. And I think a big part of it is me. Um, so I just need somebody to come in here and tell me exactly what I need to do. I don't need words of encouragement. I need someone to come in this home and tell me exactly what I'm doing. But what she's going to go ahead, her name is Miss Tasha. What she's going to do is she's going to come into the home, assess the puppy, and she is going to basically see if it's a psychological issue with him, if it's like an obedience thing, right? Which to give my dog, my puppy, some credit, um, his breed is very hard. So I hear several sources have told me this, so or I've read several sources that Bichons are very tough to potty train, but you can do it. It just takes a while. And then I have to also take in, in, in account that he's only eight months old, right? Well, it's April, May, June, July, August, September, September, December. Yeah, he's eight months old. And for eight months of his life, he's been allowed to just pee and poop anywhere where he came from. They did not take out the time to potty train him. And I get it because they had over 80 something dogs that they are selling and they just can't do that for all puppies. So, but anywho, I'm up for the challenge. I hope this is not too, too expensive, um, but yeah. So the consultation is free and we'll see if they can help us out. And, um, and yeah. I also read that some people have their dogs um, going, using the bathroom in the kitty litter. I don't know if I want that. I think I want my dog to be a dog and pee and poop outside. But anyway, the only thing that's consistent with him is he loves it with when my husband takes him out early in the morning. Hey, doodly pop. And um, he will poop and pee for my husband. He will not poop for me. Anyway, so I'm going to go ahead and finish watching season seven, starting with episode one of 60 Days In. And I'm getting on my maxi climber. Mm -hmm. My husband should be home in about maybe 30, 40 minutes. So I might as well get something in. <laughs> Psst, no, let me go. And I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Love you.